Okay, first of all, I apologize for my poor English. Uh, I've played on so this uh, little etude intended for beginners, and I'm going to give you some advice, important advice. So you need to play it slowly at the beginning, and you can increase your speed, but this will take you one minute to play it, to play the whole piece. So, the most important thing, things are the, pos the hands positions, the wrist positions. So, for the right hand, you, if you hold the guitar, uh, you see that you are uh, inclined to play with the hand, with the wrist in this position. And this is not, this is the natural, the natural uh, position, but this is not the right position. You need to turn your wrist. So, in order to get the right position, you, you, do, you do this, okay, and you turn your wrist, and the thumb must be parallel to the strings. Let me change, okay, the camera. So, you are like this, and the fingers can play can pick the strings this way, and the thumb can freely play the three uh, lower strings. But if you play like this, with the thumb hidden by the by the by the other fingers, you can play correctly. You are painting the the strings, but you are not picking it. So if you learn this way, you never be able to play a, a tremolo, for instance, or rapid arpeggios, because you had taken the wrong position to play. So remember to turn this wrist this way. This is not natural, but this is the right position for the right hand. So this sign, turn your wrist, and play like this. And another position, a little bit strange, is the left position. You need to make room. You don't need to hold the guitar like a rifle. You don't have to play like this with the palm touching the, the guitar. You need to turn the wrist like a violin player. This way you get the right positions and you can improve your playing and it will take you years to play correctly classical or finger picking guitar. Don't be in a hurry. You have all the time to play. Play all the pieces slowly at the beginning and increase your speed when you are confident.